Hi everybody, my name is Brandon Satorius. I'm a senior musical theater major here at Colorado Mesa University. Um, I'll be playing Grandpa in our upcoming production of The Naked Mole Rat, The Rock Experience. Um, so it's based on Mo Williams' children's book, uh, The Naked Mole Rat Gets Dressed. And I'm here with Carol Christ, who teaches children's literature at CMU. Hi, Hi. Hi, everyone. <laughs> yes. <laughs> So have you ever um, taught Mo Willems books before here at CMU? A couple of them. Mm -hmm. Do you know? Oh, I can't ask which ones yet. We'll get into that. And I won't tell. <laughs> um, it's a secret. Yes, yeah, it's a secret. <laughs> We're going to do some trivia about his book. So are you ready for this? Mm -hmm. Sure. Sure. Okay. okay. So let's get started. Um, according to Mo Willems books, who should not drive the bus? The pigeon, all right, you get 10 points. Okay, we're gonna start keeping points I, now. I love of... that pigeon. Oh, yes. <laughs> I've never read that. I know the book, but I've never read it personally. It's in second person. So oh, really? it addresses the reader. Yes. Oh, okay, there you go. <laughs> um, so Mo Willem's character, Elephant's first name is? I'm hoping it's Elephant. Oh, no, it's, yeah. it's Gerald, so that's minus 20 points for you. Minus yeah, 20? Yeah, so we're in negative oh, points no. now. Um, what book is that? Do you know? I don't know. I that. think there's a whole bunch of elephant creepy books. Oh, okay. Good to know. Am I getting points for that? I'll give you five points okay. for. We'll, we'll rebound with that. <laughs> um, so, in Are You Ready to Play Outside? Why is Piggy not a happy piggy? Uh, he can smell pork cooking in the apartment <laughs> next door. No, I'll give you ten points for creativity, Thank but uh, it's because it's raining outside. That's the, I think that's the sequel, actually. <laughs> um, so yeah, the piggy smells pork. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> um, Mo Willems worked for a while on Sesame Street. What was one of his contributions? Hmm. Maybe it was Oscar the Grouch. <laughs> no. Um, he directed the opening sequence for Elmo's World. I didn't even know that. Yeah. And I watched Sesame Street. So. I love Elmo. Yeah, I know. I do, too. The more, you, the more you know. <laughs> um, so let's move into some naked mole rat questions. Do you think you know a lot about naked mole rats? I know more than I did Prior. a month ago. Okay, yeah, I get you. <laughs> okay, so what continents are naked mole rats native to? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Africa or Australia or somewhere like that? Africa. All right. I'll give right, you half right, points because right. okay, you said Australia. Enough. too. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're at like 50 points now. I'm That's not keeping good. it. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, how long can naked mole rats survive without oxygen? Uh, I think I think quite a while, but uh -huh. I, I can't be specific about that. They they don't get a lot of oxygen. Yeah, it's 18 minutes. That's cool. I've never I never knew that. The more you know. <laughs> so, um, why are naked mole rats naked? Well, because there's no store down in the ground where they mm -hmm. live, <laughs> and they're born naked. Mm -hmm. And they, I, I do have a factoid on okay. their nakedness. They can actually, like, almost turn their whole skin inside out. Oh, the more you know. You should, you should see the pictures. <laughs> yes. Cool. I'll research before I do this <laughs> role. <laughs> um, the answer, I'll give you the points. It says, it's really hot in the deserts in Africa. Also, they live underground, so they don't need hair for sun protection. But I like your answer better. Thank you. So we'll give you the 10 points. Okay. How do naked mole rats stay warm when it, uh, when it does get cold? I think they huddle up with their compadres. Yes. All right. That was 20 points. <laughs> yes. Um, naked mole rats are neither mole nor rat. What animals are they most closely related to? Giraffes. <laughs> no, uh, it's porcupines, chinchillas, and guinea pigs. So oh. I guess they should be a porchina pig. pig. <laughs> there you go. Wait, now see, you circled back to piggy. Oh, there you go. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, naked mole rats are known to eat the feces of their queen. Why is that? This is 
a squeamish alert. I probably should have warned you before. I'm so sorry. Well, I know they're sort of bee-like. Mm -hmm. They don't all have sex. Okay. Um, why do they do that? Um, I, to keep the nest clean. I, I guess so, yeah. <laughs> Possibly to pass along pregnancy hormones to other naked mole rats and are more predisposed to caring for the queen's offspring. Um, why do you think she does, what do you think she does all day long? Flies around. Yeah, there you go. Just being a queen. That's what the queen does. Yeah, she just got to chill, you know? <laughs> um, a quarter of naked mole rat's um, muscle mass is in its... Jaws. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'll give you 100 points for that. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Um, what are the San Diego Zoo's naked mole rat's favorite food. Oh. Saltwater taffy. <laughs> uh, no, it's bananas. I don't even know if bananas grow in Africa, so I guess I get a treat. <laughs> um, if you had a naked mole rat as a pet, what would you name it? Mike. Mike? I think I would name mine like Deborah or something. I love like animals' names that are just like human names. Yes, yeah, because they're, yeah, they're just like names. one with you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so those were all of our questions. Do you have any questions for me? To, you can stump me, maybe. Oh, questions to stump you. Yeah. Um, well, naked mole rats could do something really cool with those teeth. Teeth. Uh -huh. and, and do you know what? Um, I don't know. I'm guessing that they can, <laughs> from my knowledge, naked mole rats can tap dance because that's what this show has in it, but I don't know what they can do with their teeth. Yeah, play the piano. <laughs> oh, I get you. Yeah, they can tap dance and play the piano. I read that they can actually move them like chopsticks. Oh, that's, oh, that's so cool. <laughs> um, all right. So I thank want you. one. I, I know. Want I want one, one now, too. Let's go, let's go to PetSmart and get one. <laughs> Um, so thank you so much, Carol, and thank you everyone for watching. Um, you can catch The Naked Mole Rat, The Rock Experience, and Robinson Theater for live social distance theater, or stream it into your home starting September 17th. Uh, thank I you once wait. again. I know, I can't, can't wait, wait either. <laughs> so I'll see you guys there. Thanks, uh, thank man. you. Thank you. <laughs>